Hello, welcome to another edition of Roger in the Raw, live and unleashed on the YouTube. Well, I'm busy tidying up my living room, sorting out mounds and mounds of vacuum cleaner leaflets and other miscellaneous brochures. But, this came through the post, which I think is going to add to the piles and piles of brochures. So, um, I bought these vintage leaflets on eBay, they were on Buy It Nows. Uh, so I bought a few of them, and the sellers kindly put in some extra ones that I didn't have to pay for. So let's have a look what they are. Now I'm going to try and pop my iPad down. This is this is not going to work, is it? Oh, no, that's covering up the doobly. Right, sorry about that. This is where a chair, I'm, I'm in the corner of my living room where I had a chair, and, uh, well, this will have to do, it's a bit close. I'm expecting my... Um, iPod mount, iPad mount to arrive from Amazon today, so um, I'll be able to do proper live videos. Now let's just cut in. Some quite interesting, vi these are really vintage, I would say. Don't want to cut, I don't want to cut into the actual leaflets. Right. Ooh. I really should make my uh, camera a bit higher up. Oh, there's lots of little... I don't think I'll be interested in a lot of these. The sailors put loads in. Right, what I'll do, folks... <sighs> so, look. Ooh. Rotate device, it says. Oh, I don't know what's happened there. Are you dizzy? There we go. Slumber down. That's not what we're here, well, not what we're here to look at. Right, I'm just going to try and raise up my doobry. And um, try not to cover up the mic, not the mic, the do. That's a little better, sort of. I don't know what way that up is up for you, but... Right, let's have a quick look. Well, not very interesting for our purposes. A little leaflet on slumber down continental quilts. Daisy has come to have a sniff. Don't know what date that is. Anyway, it's got some oldie worldy measurements on it. Not very interesting for me, but it was free. Oh, here we are. Included a few other brochures you might like from Howard. Thank you, Howard. Dulux Complete Painting Guide. Mm. Exciting. Well, it might be interesting for some folk. Right. Oh. Wow, a whole magazine look from, what's that, 80, oh, 87, Homes and Houses. Well, I wonder if there's any vacuum leaflet, uh, not leaflets, vacuum bits in here. I'll have to look at that later. They might be the odd vacuum advert. Uh, they might be an article. Often these Homes magazines would have a vacuum cleaner <laughs> with some prices of houses here. There's a house for sale in Orpington in Kent for £71,500. I think it'll cost a little bit more than that now. Let's have a quick look at the um, doobly, see if, be, if there's anything on vacuums. Doesn't look like it. Anyway, I'll look through that properly later. This is a, so it's not bad, 87, is it? 87, I said. Homes and houses. Well, that's not interesting, but now we're coming to things that might interest people who watch my channel. Whoa. The more carpet you have, the more you need Hoover. Now I bought that, that's the first thing I saw and thought, right, I'm having that. And it was a very reasonable, it was under a fiver. I've seen these go for £20 or more. But we'll look at that in a minute. Hot point, I think I bought that one. I also bought that, I'll show you in a bit more detail in a minute. And I also bought that, at home with Hoover. Right, these are extras. I think these were in the li these were for sale as well, but I wasn't interested in this baby belling friend of everyone who lives in a bed sitter. Look at that, a baby belling, a mini little kooka. Now, what's the date on this, folks? I just have to. 83! 1983, that comes from. So, any of you interested in baby bellings, there's a leaflet. Let's pop that there, I'm not really interested. Oh, now. 
It's just that I don't know there'll be some washing machine people interested in this service super twin 70 leaflet this was also for sale and I didn't buy it I thought well I don't really want that so <laughs> I've been sent it free anyway so that's good isn't it service super twin what else this oh I didn't uh, didn't pay for that either Electrolux speed cleaning power polishing mm. I might do proper videos of these, you know, I'll, I'll scan them in and do, you know, because this is just a quick live jobby. Oh, I've got a viewer, I've got a viewer. I'm sorry if you've um, commented, I've not been able to see what you're saying, if you have commented. Ooh, look at that, so I didn't expect that. That was a freebie. I'll have to thank Howard. So, um, that's good, look. What date is this? This is probably late 60s, early 70s. Hmm. Can't see. Hello, Daisy. Yes, don't walk on them. What's this one? Oh, well, not very interesting. A shower in your home. This has got some naked people in it. Why have a shower? Well, to stop you stinking to high heaven. Where will it go? Mm, bathroom, possibly? <laughs> don't think you'd have it in the kitchen. I had someone... Um, <laughs> Someone say, because they'd seen my Bissell Crosswave, that's boring, isn't it? Somebody had seen my Bissell Crosswave video and noticed that my washing machine was in the kitchen. And he was absolutely flabbergasted. And he put WTF, which I assume means why the face, doesn't it? Does WTF mean why the face? Yeah, I think it does. Anyway, this is, I saw this and it's not, it's, it's a bit of vintage Hoover, but it's, the other things Hoover used to make. So, as I say, I'll probably, um, I've got so many video, uh, not videos, so many uh, leaflets and brochures to go through. I'll do them properly, you know, I'll scan them and then you'll be able to see them properly. This is just a quick, so lots of Hoover irons there. Dry iron as well as the steam. Then we've got uh, Hoover hair dryer, more Hoover hair dryers. A lot of these have go on eBay. I've seen that fan heater on eBay recently and some of these hair dryers as well. That's, I think, an electric blanket. Then we have some very old-fashioned kettles. Do you remember kettles with wooden handles? And it's even got a wooden knob look. And on the back, we even have, for the gentleman, or the hairy lady, Hoover shavers. I doubt Hoover made these, to be honest. I would say another manufacturer would have made those for Hoover. I've even seen a Hoover electric drill. So despite the fact that this at home with Hoover brochure does feature a lady using a Hoover hand mixer, which I have owned in the past, there's no hand mixers in this. Not that I could see. Didn't see any. Did you? Yes, I didn't see them, but I thought I would have known. Oh, there's an electric knife. I didn't even notice that. It's tucked right there in the background. There's a Hoover electric knife there. Right, so that's quite interesting. Here it's pretty battered. But uh, look at that, the Hoover Conquest. The deluxe cylinder bottle that reaches right around the house. This one's a bit tatty. Pretty old. Bless her, she's having a great time. And here's the back of it. Dee -dee. Oh, does it blow? We never do that. Yes, it blows. Did you know the Hoover Conquest blew? I've never had one. No, it's got a blowing outlet. Now, can we see it now in the middle? She's attaching it there to blow. What's the date on this one? It doesn't say. But it's Hoover make things better for you, so I think it's 70s. And judging by that frock, it's 70s, isn't it? She's a bit camera shy, isn't she? Don't want to show her face. Too embarrassed? Too embarrassed to show your face, girl? Hey? I'd be embarrassed nowadays to show my face plugging a hoover, but not then. They were good then. Right, here's a hot point. I'm leaving the best till last. This is quite interesting. Oh, actually, there was one other hot point leaflet that I thought we might have included, unless somebody bought it. This comes from Walter Cobb Limited, Regent House, Kirkdale, that's said Sydenham. Never had any of these. 
that one's I've seen a few times, the whole point light and easy, and I know I've seen one of those in the flesh. Collector, fellow collectors showed me one of his. I've never seen that. You know, I bet that's rare. It's got look, they've got the prices 48 38 for that. Looks like it's a power nozzle, to be honest. Looks like there's a wire. That can't be right. What's 3972? Surely that's not 3972 and that's 40. Unless, no, that'll possibly, I don't know. Anyway, let's have a look inside. Pop it down. I've not bothered with any lights, so wow, look at that, folks. Look at that. The Hot Point Premier. Hot Point's new cylinder cleaners, the Premier and the Premier Deluxe. They always like to use the word deluxe back in the day. The best looking cleaners available. Well, I don't know. They're quite uh, handsome looking, aren't they? Definitely looks like a power nozzle. Oh, the motor brush is self-powered to give the brush and beating action of an upright vacuum cleaner. Wow, well, look at that. I bet that is uber rare. There's probably someone who's got that, collectors that have got that. I quite like the look of that. Then we have the Swallow. It's always best to swallow with a hot point. As you can see, very unusual, bit junior deluxe-ish looking that, isn't it? Tools on the back, pretty rare too, well, but all, everything in this brochure, apart from the light and easy, which was a little bit more common. And there's, speaking of light and easy, we've got all these light and easies at the back. Hot point, light and easy. And then we've just got some other bits, simple, simple and effective. And showing the tools, hot point, from GEC, I think that's General Electric Company. What's the date on that? In Peterborough, no date. I'm sure someone can roughly date that. I'm gonna say 70s. I'm going out on a limb and saying 70s for that one. Finally, folks, for this quick impromptu video, let's turn uh, the telly down. I've just got a YouTube mix on. The more carpet you have, the more you need Hoover. And there's some child, it's quite a big pile. Quite a, quite a, it almost matches my carpet. It looks it like, well, it doesn't look like that on the screen, but it does to me. Wow, sir. Now this is what I, I, I saw and I thought, oh my God, oh my God, quick, buy it now, buy it now, before someone else sees it. And I was panicking, because I had it in my basket and thought, well, I better get it bought. Because I was, but I was looking at other things the seller had for sale, but I thought, right, just buy this now. And then, because the seller refunded the extra postage, I only char was only charged one. But I've seen this brochure, similar brochures go for twenty odd pounds, and I got this for four pounds. It was a funny price; it was four seventy or something. But look, I've had all of these. Ooh, hang on a minute. I'm coming, don't worry. Just drop me. Oh. Right, sorry about that, folks. <laughs> the perils of recording live, I couldn't pause. Right, that was the postman with something from Amazon. I'm expecting something else from Amazon. Right, here we are, the, the Hoover Upright Clean. Anyway, it gave you a chance to look at this without me nattering on, but Daisy would have been barking all the way through it. So yes, I had most of these. I, had, I certainly had that. I've still got that. I've got that, as you saw, brand new. I've had them all, but currently out of that little selection, I've got a Dirt Searcher and a Junior. So that's the Hoover Uprights. More about the Hoover Uprights and some lovely comparison pictures. Here we have a lady with her very early Hoover cleaner saying 60 years on. And now up to the date lady, showing, well, showing everything she's got almost, and very proud of her Hoover convertible. And there's the famous, oh God, this leaflet. If only we had smell-o-vision, this leaflet, I'm going to give it a sniff, hang on. 
Oh, God. Oh, that's nostalgia. Oh, the smell of old paper. It's fantastic. So, um, here we are, some tools. Look at the wallpaper. Look at the frocks. Look at the carpets. That's how we used to live. No taste. Focus? Are you going to focus? No, you're not. What else have we got in this lovely, lovely brochure? <gasps> the Hoover Suction Cleaners for floor-to-ceiling cleaning all over the home. Oh, look, there she is again. Look, isn't that funny? The woman, she still can't show her face. She's, she's got the conquest there, but she's now having a go with the old constellation. But still, oh, I'm shy. She can't show her lovely, lovely face. She's probably an old boiler. She's probably related to someone from Hoover and they said, here, we'll bang you 50 quid, put this rock on and hold this. I'm not showing my face. Well, don't, love. So she hasn't. So there we are. Oh, look, there's the Harlequin. I had one of those. Oh, there, uh, that's exactly the one I had, look. The Tartan Harlequin. You can almost hear the bagpipes. And there we have the cylinder. And that looks like the constellation I've got, isn't it? Yes, that is. It's out of focus. I'm going to look at getting a new lens. You can get lenses to attach and mics and things for the iPad. I really need a new iPad. And there's the Conquest again. Lovely. And I think probably all of those have got a lot of metal in. All metal. And I think that's possibly metal bodied. The Harlequin has a metal body, but it's got a vinyl covering. And I think, I would think, the Conquest also has a metal body but with a vinyl covering on it and finally we have hoover lightweight cleaners and polishers so we've got the hooverette in the orange colorway probably the latest version that in the orange colorway then the hoover runabout carpet sweeper the dustette and the shampoo polisher and polisher and hoover make things better for you what's the date on this no date Again, it's, well, it's either late 60s, possibly, late 60s, early 70s, would you say? I've got to show her again. Look at her. She's not, unless that's the same woman who's actually showing her face. Perhaps they gave her another 50 quid to, to you know, to turn around and smile. Come on, fuck us. Fuck us. There. Well, you can't get close with an iPad. It's ridiculous. Oh, that's, I've gone on for far too long. It's a trouble doing it live. I can't edit. So, there we are. A few little brochures received in the post today. They're the ones I... Well, the ones I paid for. I didn't pay for... I think I paid for all those. Yes. Those are the, those are the four that I actually paid for. And then I got all this for free, but of limited interest to me. But somebody might want to buy that service twin tub one off me at some point but anyway there you go quick live video I knew it I knew as soon as I started doing the live YouTube you won't be able to stop me well I'm stopping now because it's going to be on for far too long right how do I stop this thing <laughs> how do I, stop? I don't think I don't know if I've had any any chats no one viewer but no chatting probably one of my haters tuned in to see that me well hello hater if you're a hater if you're not a hater welcome and goodbye um how do i turn this thing off oh finish there we are that's easy enough so i'll see you later i've got a new vacuum to unbox later today you'll be seeing that on friday so until then i'll be off bye for now <laughs>